Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 1194. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on the link below the video. Hey, I did an accounting seminar the other day, and this example here of doing a V lookup with the number 13 into this data set and a VLOOKUP of going from this ID of 13 into this data set got the biggest oohs and ahs. And it's all about data mismatch. These are numbers. This is text. These are text. This is number. Now, why does this happen? Because we get data dumps, and sometimes our numbers show up as text. Sometimes they show up as numbers. Now, let's just run our VLOOKUP equals VLOOKUP. All I want to do is look up the ID, comma, within this table right here. Comma, the thing I want to return is from the second column. Column index is 2, comma, and I'm doing exact match here. So I'm going to put a 0, or you can put false. Control Enter and NA. If you put it into edit mode F2 and double click this in F9, you can prove to yourself that the formula thinks it's text because it's in double quotes. But these are numbers over here. So how do we get that text number back to a number so it matches? Control Z. Any math operation will convert a text number back to a number. And you can see that over there. And when I do Control Enter, it works perfectly. The reverse sometimes happens. We have a number, and we need to match it against a text number. So here we're going to say equals VLOOKUP there. And here's our table right here comma 2, comma 0, close parentheses, NA, F2, no problem. Now we need to go and convert a number to text so it matches over here. So I simply come here and I join using the ampersand to a zero length text string, double quote, double quote. And that will do it. Right now, if I double click and F9 that, yeah, that's a number you can see. If I highlight the whole thing in F9, now it's a text number. Now it can be matched. Control Z, Control Enter. So sometimes our data mismatches number matched up against text numbers. And in that case, we use ampersand zero length text string. If we have text and we need to match it up against number, then we use any math operation like plus zero. All right, we'll see you next video.